All right, so this is number 39 out of section 3.2.1, the first section of, um, of the, the second section of chapter 3, um, on page 203. So in this problem, we're given um, this expression, which looks a little jumbled. Um, so our task is to actually make it a little less complicated. And if you notice, up top here, I wrote down the definitions of the um, the two things we're dealing with. So right here we have exponents. Um, the base to the exponent is equal to the argument. And then another way of writing of that is the logarithm of base b, and the bases are the same, um, the logarithm base b of the argument in is equal to the exponent k. So in this case, I'm going to go ahead and make sure that I have all of my players here, and I meant to make this red here. Right, um, and it looks like I had. I can identify that I have my base here of four. Okay, I have my argument up here, and it appears as though I'm missing something. I'm missing k. Well, we need to figure out what k could equal, um, because that'll tell us what the whole thing is. So. I notice that with the way this is set up with the logarithm, I'm not going to be able to do much. So I'm going to go ahead and rewrite it as an exponential function. Now identify my base. Well, my base, and you start with the base, is 4. Now it's 4 to the k power. I don't know what k is in this case. Okay. Again, this was the exponent, k. I don't know what k is, so I'm going to go ahead and leave k right there. And that is equal to the argument. Well, in this case, the argument we identified as 4 to the 3x. Now, looking at this, there's actually a rule that states that if our bases are the same, that our exponents are in, we have two equations with equal exponent or equal bases, then their exponents must all be also be equal. But if we kind of look at this as four to the blank is equal to four to the three x, well it seems pretty obvious that k must be three x. So in this case we know that k is equal to three x. Therefore, the log base 4 of 4 to the 3x is equal to 3x. This also ties into the fact that these are inverses. Um, so if we have log base 4 and then another base 4 basically of an exponent, that it will more or less cause a cancellation.